Hello, everyone. How are y'all today? I wanted to take a minute to show you the shine of my hair. Y'all, this is, sil we're calling it silver. This is silver hair. And let me tell you, it is probably uh, the roughest curve hair to keep soft and shiny. But look at that shine. And also, I have to switch to a permanent purple because that temporary purple just comes out way too quick. Of course, it's a nice bottle of it. I can add it anytime I want to. I just have to remember. All right. So, how are you guys today? It is like the 8th of January. So, we are a whole week into January. I still have on my incredible... <laughs> Look at that. What is on my ring? My incredible nail fee. I mean, my incredible colors. Look at that. That's called um, Tanzanite Temptation and Less Bitter, More Glitter. And I'm totally obsessed with it. I like to switch my nails every week, but I can't bring myself to it. I don't want to take this off. It's so pretty. <laughs> but... I'll get to it sometime this week because it's time. Uh, I also hurt my thumbnail and it's kind of pulling away from the thing. And now it's got a little crack in it that is probably not going to be really good when we get going. All right. So I had to go get some new elf. So let's get that opened. I love this stuff. It makes my skin feel really nice on top. Of course, you know, I use my um, $13.50. It did have a price raise, but this stuff is the best. Y'all look at my skin. It really looks really good considering I'm 54 years old, right? Okay, let's get this going. All right. Let's put that e.l.f. primer on. I really like this mineral one that I'm using. I think it feels super good on my skin. Now, where did I just put the lid? Literally, y'all saw me open it. <laughs> this is my life. <laughs> All right. Let's get going. It's Monday morning. It's really Monday afternoon. It's a little afternoon. I go to work at one, so let's get headed to work today. If you guys have not joined me yet at Flawlessly Festive VIPs on Facebook, please come and do so. I have some really great deals, all kinds of specials, all kinds of giveaways. I have a game night every week, and I just moved it to Sunday nights. And I usually, most of the time, I leave that open um, for a day to give everyone time to play. Uh, unless I do just a one-night game. Every once in a while, I did, last night, I did a one-night, one-winner game. But a lot of times, I do stuff where everyone has the chance to win. All you have to do, oh, there it is. All you have to do is, um, I don't know why I put that down, is participate. Some base on this face. I swear one day I'm gonna go in public like this. Smile at everyone. <laughs> See if anyone says anything. I'd love to do this actually and have a have my camera up and record the faces <laughs> that people make when, when they see me because it'd probably be super funny. Y'all, that's just who I am. I'm I'm literally this ridiculous in real life y'all when I'm sitting here recording for you guys <laughs> I'm just being me 
something I like about people when people are just themselves because there's no reason to try to be someone else because you'll come off as fake. You know why? Because you're not anyone else. You're just yourself. So always, always, always love yourself. Treat yourself with kindness and respect and expect that everyone around you will treat you the same with kindness and respect. And for those that don't treat you with kindness and respect, bye-bye. There's the door. Right? You don't have to be mean. You just don't have to allow them in your life. Sounds super simple, doesn't it? All right. Let's go with some highlighter balm on that lower section first. I'm going to go right there, right below my mole. Do you guys have a mole like that? My mama had one. I have one. I actually really like it. I used to not like it. I think it would be really cool if it was there like Marilyn's, right? <laughs> it ain't. But that's all right. All right, and now we're going to go in with some bronzer balm. I love the balms, y'all. I really, truly do. I'm pretty sure I'm never going to go back to powder. I might have to play with that a little bit. Um, and, you know, you can layer the powder on top of the bronzer even, or vice versa, I think. I think. So, um... I mean, I have it. I do need to use it up. Of course, this stuff is going to last me a long, long, long time. I mean, I've been using this for months now, and I've got a long, long ways to go. So, it is worth every penny to have a high-end makeup that has stuff in it that's good for your skin. no junk in it. It's a clean makeup. I think that's making a difference on how my skin looks along with my um, face cream. There we go. Now for some blush balm. Y'all, I've been using that for months. Seriously, for months. I like to tap it in and then rub it in in little circular motion. Just kind of blend it right into that. Bronzer. All right. And let's top that off with some highlighter. Give a little sparkle to the skin there. So that's how it looks before it's all blended in. I don't know, I might need to, you know what, I'm going to add a little bit more blush, I think. Just in that back area a little bit. Without coming all the way to the front there. Let's just darken that up just a little bit. All right, there we go. All right, let's brush out those eyebrows. I remember to do that first because I know there's many people that say, do something with your eyebrows, do something with your eyebrows. <laughs> so I'm working on it, y'all. I'm not very good at it, so, but I'm working on it. So let's go ahead and do something with my eyebrows. Let's try um, this pharmacy. I like this one because it's super easy 
to just put in there like that. So I do like this one for that reason because you see it's got the four little do my hitchies on it. There you go. I did a little something with my eyebrows. Not much. <laughs> but I'm trying a little bit. I do have this thing. I'm kind of scared to use it. Okay. So, like, you just do that with it. But I, oh, it's it's got the things and it. It's more at an angle. I don't know. It doesn't really leave lines like the other one does so I haven't tried it yet but maybe I'll try it tomorrow all right some elf this is actually called a uh, elf putty color correcting eye brightener I thought this was something a little bit different and then when I was in the store buying the my replacement primer and I, I saw this I was like oh well I have been definitely brightening my eyes with it. I wonder if I could use it under my eyes too before I get started in the morning. Maybe I'll try that tomorrow. But it definitely brightens my eyes considerably. Alright. I did buy some brushes. <laughs> um, I left them in my car. So, I don't have them in here with me, so maybe I'll try to remember to bring them in tonight. But I did buy some brushes. Someone said that they were impressed that I used my fingers to do... I have never been very good with brushes, really, truly. I mean, I do use brushes for some things. Um, I used to always use the brush on my eyeshadow, and I saw someone else doing it with their fingers, and I thought, well, that looks way easier than trying to fancy it up with without or with the brush so um of course I didn't use the right brushes I just use whatever brush so I did buy some eye makeup brushes because I really want to try one of those cut creases will it work I don't know will it look good I don't know am I gonna try it you betcha I saw how you can do it with a spoon and get a nice clean, clean, um, cut crease. So I may try it with a spoon to make it easier the first time. I don't know. I might just have to see her one day and do all kinds of makeup tricks. Maybe I'll do, uh, with the spoon on one side and without the spoon on the other side when I'm not going anywhere so that I can see how it looks. <laughs> We shall see. I also saw with the hooded eyes a way that you can do a, um, which I've never thought that I look good with a wing, uh, but I saw, and that may be why I've never looked good with a wing, because I wasn't doing it properly for the type of eyes that I have, so I'm going to try that. Y'all, to me, makeup is fun, and I enjoy it. Um... I do not wear makeup every day. If you see me out and about around town, I may have makeup on. I may not have makeup on. I don't care. It's just whatever suits my mood for the day, honestly. Okay, open. Sesame. Let's get some powder on my face. Y'all, I'm not going to do my lips right now because... I have another video I need to make specifically to the lips. I'm going to be putting on um, Batty and uh, Blackberry. I'm super excited. Look how good those colors are going to look together. So I'll be doing a different video. So watch for that because I will post it here too. Not quite ready to open my new mascara yet, but I'm getting there. I'm getting there. 
it's getting to the point of it's about time. I think I can squeeze another few uses out of it before I switch. Y'all, I always have a napkin on my lap, and I'm wiping everything off between everything that I do, um, just so you know. I still haven't looked up how long to do this. Oh, my gosh. One of these days, I will remember to look up how long you're supposed to hold this to actually curl your eyelashes. I thought about it yesterday, and then totally forgot. <laughs> I can think about something and forget about it all in the same thought. <laughs> Oh, Lordy. All right. So, mascara time. Yeah, I can definitely tell that it's about time to switch that out. But I don't know if I have a regular mascara or not. And I maybe I'll the next go round I'll use the waterproof because I should probably test that too because I haven't. But I generally don't wear um, waterproof mascara. So there's the look today, minus the lips. I'm gonna go do another video. Um, in my group, actually, because I promised someone I'd show them this one. <coughs> so I'm going to go do that, and I will record a video and share it in here also. All right, you guys. Y'all have a wonderful, wonderful day. I will be back in the next couple of days or so. Who knows? Y'all have a good one. Bye.